y'all. So I got a package in the mail. I don't know why it's showing up like that. I don't know. But it is from Dossier. This isn't sponsored. But Dossier, if you want to sponsor, hey, hit your girl up. So I ordered some more perfume. And I got the, when you open it up, it says the Iconic Sense Designer Quality No Markup. So for those of y'all that don't know, and if you don't know, I've never heard of Dossier. I don't know where you've been hiding. But uh, it's basically where you can go get dupes. Um, dupe, perfume, um, cologne. Basically, you don't have to pay that, what, high price of two, three hundred dollars <laughs> You can go get it and for the most part the perfumes colognes or whatever smell exactly like the high price end um fragrances so the scent that i got this time is fruity almond which is this right here. And it is a dupe to the uh, Carolina Herrera Good Girl Auto Parfum. And the top notes are almond peach. The middle notes are orange, orange blossom, and tuberose. And the base notes are tonka bean, vanilla, and cocoa. So, Smells pretty good. I'm just going to spray it on here. You can come by. This. Gonna spray it. Oh, that smells so good. It smells so fruity. Oh, my gosh. That smells so good. So, yeah, I'm just getting home from work. Uh, ordered the hubby and I some bundles because I had a craving for a salad. So, um, yeah, so I'll leave all the uh, description and everything down below in the description box. So, I will touch back in with you guys later. close to the end of the day it is 4 30 and i am tuckered i'm so ready to get out of here but i got a lot accomplished so i will check back in with you guys probably when i get home all right y'all this is getting close to the end of the day it is 4 30 and i am tuckered I'm so ready to get out of here, but I got a lot accomplished, so I will check back in with you guys probably when I get home. Hey y'all, good afternoon. So, I am off today. I have been lounging around all day, y'all. I was going to go in for half a day. Because I put in for the whole day off. Sorry about the lighting. But I was going to go in for half a day today. And get off at 12. But they're talking about this storm. And it raining and stuff. And I was like, mm, yeah. I'm not going in. And if y'all 
in the corporate world, medical field, or whatever you know about fiscal year and ending. So my fiscal year ends, woo, my fiscal year ends next Thursday. And a new fiscal year, our fiscal year goes from July until June. So I'm like, you know what? I'll get it done. It is what it is, y'all. It is what it is. But I forgot to come back on here the other day and show y'all what I got from Sephora, my Sephora haul. So, y'all yeah, thought I got some stuff from Elf and um, from Ulta, the Good Molecules toner and stuff. Um, just finished doing some skincare a little while ago. My skin's looking better. I need to get that uh, serum that fades like scars and stuff to see if it works. But yeah. I don't know how to get rid of those. I think those were like moles or whatever. But anyway, let me set you guys up and I will show you what I got from Sephora, y'all. Alright, y'all. So, before I open up my little Sephora haul... I'm about to start reading this book called The Return of Elle or Ellie Black by Amiko G. This book here. And what it's about, it is about Detective Chelsea Calhoun. And her sister went missing 20 years ago. And ever since she's been trying to, you know, find clues, basically try to find out where her sister is. And this young lady appears after being, after disappearing. Uh, I think for about four years. And she won't tell where she was, who she was with, like she's protecting somebody. So, uh, detective, I guess it's up to Detective Calhoun to figure out what happened to her. And hopefully he can find her sister also. But yeah, once again, it's by Amiko Jean, The Return of Ellie Black. So, let's get into this little Sephora haul. Um, I wanted to try some of these products, so, yeah. This was after, um, I'm not going to say how much I spent, so. <laughs> it's like, I don't know where my blade is, I'm trying to use these dull scissors to get into the box. All right, here. Come on. Goodness, why is it making it so hard to open? There. Okay. So, I think I got a total of seven items. I think I purchased five, and I got two samples, I believe. Yeah, two, three, four, five. But I only see one of my samples. Seriously? Well, y'all, I only got one sample. Yep. Okay, so the sample that I got is this uh, by Origins. It's a ginseng into the glow brightening serum. It's only what, 0.5 ounces of product. So that's uh, one of the samples. And I was supposed to get, I think it was a perfume sample, but that's neither here nor there. All right, so first off, I wanted to try or I purchased this. It is. Uh, Eight is it's by Fleur basically Fleur Discovery Set Ensemble. It's eight different all doll parfums in here. Um, it is Apricot Privé, Lost Cause, Tangerine Boy, Missing Persons, Somebody Would, Solar Power, Father Figure, and Not Your Baby. So I wanted to give this a try. To see if I like these little auto perfumes or the the scent basically, and then to about purchasing 
the bigger version because I refuse to go out and purchase a big bottle of perfume, spend a whole lot of money, and end up not even liking the scent. So, yeah. That's for that purchase. And I like the way that they did this packaging. They put it in some packing, some plastic packaging just in case it leaks. And this is the Sol de Janeiro uh, 59 um, oil mist, which I wanted to give it a try, y'all. Mm, it's wrapped up, so I'm not going to unwrap it. But yeah, plastic bottle. Wanted to see if I like it, if it is all the hype. All the hype. And then I purchased by Summer Fridays in the uh, shade, what shade is this? Ice Coffee, the Lip Butter Balm. I am using another one now, which is the shade Vanilla Beige, which I love this, y'all. I love it, love it, love it. So I wanted to see if this looks as good as this one so yep that was a purchase and then the last two items kind of go together um if you've been on youtube facebook or whatever uh, i know you've been seeing the rave about the fenty skin tan moisturizer so i got the shade six i was looking at somebody else's uh video and they got the shade 8. And I'm like, mm, I don't know if 6 is going to work for me. But, yeah. That's the shade I got, which is 6. And then I just got the uh, case where uh, once this is all gone, instead of purchasing both things, you can just take this out of the case and keep the case and just get a refillable another one of these. So, hopefully, I like, let me see, let's see if we can do a uh, swatch. Mm, I don't know, y'all. I really don't know. I it's going to come out the box. Okay. Hmm. That's what it looks like. Ooh, hopefully it matches. Hold on, y'all. All right, y'all. So I have put some on my hand. So <laughs> I don't know. Let's see. Okay. I think this is a pretty good match. It rubbed into my hand. Kind of fine. So. I think that's a pretty good match. I'm going to test it out and hopefully see. But yeah, just wanted to come on and show you all what I got from, like I said, uh, my Sephora haul because I forgot to come on the other day and show you guys. I was like, oh, I forgot to show the peeps what I got. Mm. God, I love this vanilla beige lip butter. So hopefully I like that iced coffee. So, yeah, let me get off of here. I may check back in with you guys. I may not. It all depends. I'm not sure. But I hope you all are having a wonderful day. And I'm probably going to include this in probably in a weekly vlog because I didn't do anything today but just chill around the house. And I'm about to continue chilling around the house. So I will talk to you guys later. Bye. <laughs> Hey y'all, good morning. Hope you all are having a fantastic morning. I'm just hopping on here and me and the hubby are having a day date today. <laughs> we are going to the movies to see Bad Boys Ride or Die. Been hearing good things about the movie. So we're just going to catch a matinee. Um... Yeah, it is about 10, 18, and I think the movie we're going to see or the time is about 11.45. So I'm in the process of getting ready. It's real gloomy here today. 
Um, they say it's not gonna rain, but it looks like it's gonna rain. So yeah, just hop it on here to open up this vlog and say hey, good morning, and I will see you guys later. to 10 I'm gonna give it what you think a 8.5 or 9 it was pretty good it had its hilarious moments but yeah I think it's gonna be another part so we are getting ready to head back to the house I'll see you guys then hey y'all good morning Good afternoon, good evening, whenever, whatever time you're seeing this video. I'm Mary. Welcome to a, another vlog. Um, so today I'm venturing out. I need to take back, uh, where is it? I need to take back this Fenty uh, Skin Tint Moisturizer that I purchased online back to Sephora. Um, I got it in the shade 6, and I thought that it would match my skin tone, but it's not. It's a little too light, y'all. So, yeah. <laughs> Turn this light on. So, yeah. Go right up here and flick down. So, I am about to get ready to head and take this back. Um, I could make it work because I tried to put it on. Well, I put it on um, over the weekend. And I had to do a lot of blending. I blended it, blended it, blended it. But it just, it. I don't know. So I'm just going to take it by, like I said, I got it in the shade 6. So I think I'm going to take it to, I don't know, between 7 and 8. I guess I'll try both of them in there. But I think I'm more of a 7. And then I need to probably run by either Home Depot or Lowe's and get some filters. Because the hubs got the wrong size filters. And yeah, got to get some of those. And come back and get my clothes out for the week. And oh my eyes. Get my clothes out for the week. I was going to take these braids out. But I think I'm going to leave them in. Um, probably till the weekend. Because I'm working Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So probably take them out Friday. Because I want to wash my hair. And I want to relax it. Um, and the girls are still gone, 
So I'll probably have Nani to do it, put some more braids in or a plaits when she gets back, uh, probably a week before they get ready for school. And I still haven't heard anything back yet, um, whether they got accepted into this school or not that they want to go to. Well, Nani want to go to Neary. She could care less. <laughs> she could care less. So, yeah, um, they said I would know something by July 1st, but dang, I thought at least that they would send it early, but I guess not. I guess I gotta wait. So, yeah, let me get off of here. I am waiting on one of my friends to come. We're gonna, um, both go out to the town center. I hate going out there. And we're probably going to grab something to eat. I want to try Red Robin. I've never tried Red Robin. Well, I don't go to the town center. Unless it's absolutely something that I have to go get. I think this will be my third time going since it's been out there. But, yeah. I think I want to try Red Robin. I've never eaten there before. And y'all know I might have to swing by my Starbucks. But, Yeah. Let me get off of here. I'm watching Ellen Mian right now, waiting on her to come. And so I can take this stuff back. Y'all, another thing I have. Hold on, let me set y'all up. Sephora to switch this out and they're about to skin match me. A seven would have been too light. A seven would have been too light. See, look, let me take a picture. So I'm getting ready to head into Home Depot. I got to get these filters um, for the AC. Aisle 11. This don't look like Oh. Mama, you're to 
Oh, they got the three pack. All right, y'all. So I am back home. And I was able to switch out the uh, Fenty moisturizer. Uh, like I said, I got it in shade six, and that did not work. It was too light. So I thought I would be a shade seven, but uh, she switched it out for uh, eight. So hopefully it matches. And she did a swatch while I was in the store. And I purchased three more additional items, y'all. I purchased um, some toner by The Ordinary. It's a glycolic acid 7% exfol exfoliating toner, which is that right there. <clears throat> and that is what it looks like. So, hopefully, that works. Because, y'all, I am trying to clear up my skin and nothing I'm using seems to be working. Because I have big pores and stuff. So, hopefully, this will work. And then, I wanted to try. This is by, who is this by? I totally forgot. Uh, oh, it was uh, Urban Decay. It's a setting spray, the all night <clears throat> setting spray. The long lasting makeup setting spray. So I wanted to try this and, you know, see how good it is. And last but not least, I got this makeup in the Sephora brand. Um, it's just the uh, Sephora makeup. I didn't even know they sold, they had their own brand of makeup, y'all. And this is what it looks like. I got it in the shade uh, 60 Ebony Deep Red. Um, it's a powder. So I wanted to try to see if I could pair this along with this. Um, to see how it works or to wear this along. Um, it has like, I guess like golden undertones. So I'm trying to see if it was plastic on here. I can't see. I wanted to open it up, but oh, there is plastic right here. Hold up, let me see if I can take this plastic off. Like this. 60, so I can show y'all exactly what it looks like. Alright. So, that's what it looks like. I did a little swatch. And that blended in very well. So yeah, I'm gonna probably do a look with this and see how it goes. So I'll probably touch back in with you guys. It is about 3.30. I thought I would have been back home by now, but yeah, that's neither here nor there. So I'm probably going to go in here and get ready to take a nap. Probably like an hour nap. I don't have to cook. We're having leftovers. So I'll see you guys in a little bit.